I became involved with CEOs Against Cancer when another CEO asked me to be involved. And I think it's a very important issue. Cancer is a very high cost item for business, but more important than that, it's a very debilitating thing for employees. This is very personal. I am a widow. My husband died of cancer three years ago. Bringing awareness to our team members around the sorts of lifestyle choices and behaviors that will um, help them be healthier is, is a really good thing for everybody. It's a win-win for them to be healthy. It's a win for us to have healthy team members. I mean, what's better than that if we have a group of employees that feel like they're living a healthier life in a great work environment? I think it's also showing leadership for, for our employees. And I think that's very important. And you got to walk the talk. And so that's one reason why I do this. When I talk with my colleagues, other CEOs, they're not 100% sure of where to start, and they find when, when they connect with ACS, the programs are there, the structure is there, so people can move forward, really, and move into a place where there's a very positive impact. We can give experience and advice to others about the kinds of programs we put in place, and really the personal commitment that it takes from the CEO and the senior level management team to really make a difference in the lives of people around us. We all have a thirst for knowledge and understanding what other companies are doing, what other CEOs are doing. And to me, sharing with other CEOs against cancer, the steps that they're taking, we'll learn from. And I hope that I'll become better and our company become better and better corporate citizens and better for the health of our employees and the health of our community.